of that loud baby getting some trail it's just awesome what a it's just such a great feeling to be hiking the PCT I have fallen in love with this trail uh, live out loud baby fish tank style go out there and make some noise and off the woods lake off the woods lake aloha lake of the woods not off huh no beach impediment I'm talking like little John nothing but love baby anytime I can make fun of little John the way he talks down there and lower Alabama I don't know if I ever told the story I may have if I did I apologize but we're talking to these one girls around a campfire one night and one girl goes from well she goes I'm from the OC you know she's Orange County and one girl says well I'm from LA you know and these they're young pretty girls and uh little John says well I, yeah I'm from in his slang yeah I'm from LA too and she's looked at him she's like where and he goes I'm from LA and she goes, no, you're not. He goes, yeah, I am. Lower Alabama. So that was kind of funny. Shout out to my buddy, Little John. Um, he gets, uh, he has his surgery in a week. Um, having a hard time healing up. Physical therapy ain't working, so they're going to operate and do something. So wish the best to him. Get well, buddy. Um, come April or May, we're hitting this thing. So I need you with me. Contrast with the colors and the stone, and polished rock. That right there is why I do this. This is Aloha Lake, or Lake Aloha. I think it's Aloha Lake, so it's called. Pretty cool. Everybody, fish tank here. So, as has happened 10 times on this trail, and now happened for the 11th time, if you've watched my blog, you probably already know what's coming. Look what I found. I'm, I'm way excited. Huh. Look at that, guys. 1,100 miles. Prior to this trip, I've never backpacked a day in my life. I've never done an overnight backpacking trip. I've never owned a big, you know, backpack. And uh, today I just got to the 1,100 mile mark. Ah, look at that. <laughs> now that right there is living out loud. Oh. Oh man, 1,100 miles everybody. Fish tank, living out loud, right there. Ah, oh, woo, look at that. I don't know if it's gonna come out, but, huh. Yeah, baby. All right, I'm gonna turn this off, take some pictures. We got snow cone here. He's up here in front of me. I'll have him take some pictures. Ah, oh, 1,100 miles. What an epic summer it's been. Fish tank out. Hey, everybody. So, made it to mile 1103 and some change. A lake called Gilmore Lake. Um, it's about halfway up the uh, climb up to Dick's Pass, which is nice. We weren't originally going to camp here. Um, we were going to camp a mile back, but by getting this one mile done, we're halfway up the climb up to Dick's Pass, which tomorrow's really our only serious climb, which is nice. 
plan for tomorrow is either 17 or 19 miles. We're going to have to wait and see how we feel. I'm sure we'll do the 19 miles. Um, but just really cool lake. In a minute, I'll spin the camera around and show you Gilmore Lake. Walk down there. A lot of lakes up here. Uh, there's Susie Lake, um, Gilmore Lake, um, Aloha Lake. You guys saw the pictures of that in the video. That was just really surreal. Really cool looking. This is our cool camping spot right here tonight. And uh, Snow Cone and I both have the same type of tent. I just have uh, the camo ver camouflage version, and he's got the factory blue, the Z Pax duplex. Gilmore Lake. Some people way over there. And we've got another uh, couple, a man and a woman. They're just right over there somewhere. Talk to them. For, oh, there, yeah, they're right up there. They're pretty cool. Talk to them for a minute. But that's right up there. I'm looking through the back of the GoPro. So right, like right there somewhere. Boop. That's Dick's Pass. So what we do is we leave. We kind of, I'm on the trail. I'm actually on the PC. Well, no, I'm not on the PCT. The PCT, actually, um, we got to go up this trail, go back down about, about one-tenth of a mile. And then the PCT actually comes right up the back of this ridge and then goes up, 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 up to the top of Dick's Pass and then over. So there you go. Pretty cool. Nice cold water, uh, filtered some. I just had dinner. I had mac and cheese and some a jello pudding pack. I packed in four of those lunchable sized jello pudding uh, puddings. So I had a pudding, a couple handfuls of Skittles for some sugar, three uh, three uh, servings of uh, macaroni and cheese. That's my dinner for the night. And then uh, I'm gonna have hot chocolate tonight. Not that it's cold, but I just I just kind of have a problem falling asleep. Um, I've had several nights out here on the PCT where. We go to bed at nine o'clock, everybody's out, and I'm, I'm laying there till one, two, sometimes three in the morning. So I'm gonna have some hot chocolate tonight. I did buy some, and uh, see if that helps me relax. <laughs> what are you doing there, Snow Cone? I'm filling up a water bottle. He is filtering water, there you go. And I already did a whole video on water, filter, water filtration. And there's a guy over here we talked to just a minute ago. In fact, wave, wave there, brother. Give us a wave. There he is. We're gonna, we're actually gonna introduce this uh, gentleman. I don't even know. What was your name? Jeremy. We're actually gonna introduce Jeremy to Luco Tape. So he's out here hiking and he's done a bunch and he's got some blisters. Well, Snow Cone and I both have our PhD in blister. <laughs> what is it? Blister technology. Blister management. Yeah, management. <laughs> That's the word I was after. Management. No, I was gonna say prevention because. Yeah, we haven't got that down, but we've got PhDs in blister uh, management, so we're going to help uh, Jeremy out with some Luco tape. But no, it's just a great night. The sun's going down. We've had a really good day of hiking. We did about 13 miles. I hit the big 1,100 mile mark. You guys also will see the picture of that at the end of this video. Really cool. Way, way, way happy. Um, I hit those, and I get all all the emotions come back at those uh, those. Uh, those 100 mile markers so pretty cool but uh, I'm gonna turn this off we're gonna have a, a restful evening make ourselves some hot chocolate watch the lake I'm gonna I downloaded here's my here's my uh, my vice on the trail is I downloaded some movies on Netflix we're only gonna be out four days so powers not an issue and uh, I'm gonna finish watching the second half of uh, Mississippi Grind with Ryan Reynolds and some other Yahoo I don't reckon I don't know but it's a pretty decent movie. I watched half of it last night in the hotel room and I fell asleep. So that's what we're gonna do. Hope this finds everybody healthy, happy, and well. Um, if not, get there. If uh, if you're not happy, make a change. Do something. So for me. It was getting out of uh, it was getting out of law enforcement, calling it quits, and coming out and doing something something so crazy as hiking 1,100 miles. So I'll make it happen, Captain. Hope this finds everybody healthy, happy, and well. Keep smiling. Um, I love to hear from people. If you got any questions? Any comments? 
anything, you know, you can get me on Instagram, Jason Ashley. So, see you guys later.